six something in the morning. 26. The sun is rising. We have arrived. Where are we again? Thornapple Kellogg Middle School. There you go. Amy opens the back of the truck where the gear is. The first thing she says is. <laughs> <laughs> she, to, she goes, oh crap! <laughs> Something is not set properly, but that's cool. It's riding for kilometers instead of That's cool. Anyway, so it's the 27th ish yes. National 24 Hour Challenge. Challenge. Amy's second. Mm -hmm. Dave's over there somewhere. It's his 26th. Yes. He's ridden like 8,000 miles. Anyway, it's very, very nice. We're going to go check in. It's a very nice morning. <laughs> Your pre race interview. Welcome to Middle School, Michigan, the 28th National 24 Hour Challenge. This year we have riders from several countries 18 riders from Canada. Any final words? 1985. Velocity wheels since 1994. Chevrolet since 1994. Okay. Casio watches since 1995. Dave, any final words? Eagle Jewelers since 1999. This year. McDonald's of Caledonia since 2000. It is. State Environment Insurance of Middleville since 2000. Okay. Princeton Tech Lighting since 2001. Back this year, night sun and snappy butter. Okay. And new this year, snappy packs. We're going to have first place, father and daughter. Okay, there you go. We have sh Riders into the very first checkpoint. Everybody has to stop and get their uh, bag checked or their back checked. But they're going really fast. They've just had a tailwind and they're going really fast. Guys that are serious will just grab water or whatever or pound right through. Comes Amy into the first checkpoint. Hey. Hi. Hey. <laughs> I'm good. I need a protein shake quick. Hi.
So this is the sort of thing that would only happen to Sean. I stopped at, uh, where I'm on my way from one checkpoint to another, and I found myself in the middle of a parade. Sorry about the siren, I said parade. I'm in, I'm in Nashville, Michigan. There's a car show. There's a car show going on. And that's really loud. There's a car show going on and there also uh, just happens to be a small parade going on. So a little festival going on here in Nashville. I just met Abe Lincoln. You'll have to come to my uh, Facebook picture or page or something to find a picture of me with Abe Lincoln. And uh, somehow I need to find a way to get out of this parade <laughs> so I can get to the next checkpoint. Anybody made fun of your bike this year? I got one compliment so far. Oh, compliment, good. Very nice bike. <laughs> Wasn't even sarcastic. Good. Yeah. It's retro cool. That's right. <laughs> so we're back at the school. This is the main circle now for the rest of the rest of the night. They'll come through here in regular loops. Probably make that 10,000 this year, but boy, next year, watch out. Jim Just talks on and on and on and on. He does a good job. Loop now, right? A new long loop. Middle loop. Middle loop. Bye. 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 Rider number 52 is Amy Miller. Amy Miller from Holland, Michigan on her second 24-hour challenge, uh, following out David Gearlings from Holland, rider 53. This is his 27th national 24-hour challenge, rider number one. Hi. 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 said 6 o'clock. That was pretty good. Nice job. Thank you. Papa needs a leg massage, quick. That can be mom's job. We already did that. I mean, bad cramps. Yeah? Yeah. You want salt? Yes. Roll-its? Uh, I drank this whole thing. Do you want roll I know. Uh, I broke. Me too, me too. <laughs> Two of them. Alright. Oh. Okay, you're good to go. Alright. Okay. Uh, Bye, guys. You're only halfway done. I know. 170 miles and halfway done. Now I need to ride around in circles for the next 12 hours. Yeah. Ready? Don't okay. be light yet. No. Riders come in here, get their time punch. Every every checkpoint, they get their time punched on their back off their card so they get their official time. So he's at 350. So you get a little word of encouragement from the volunteers as well. They've been riding this uh, five and a half mile loop around the school since about uh, just before dark last night. It's a little safer, controlled environment for them. Go, Mom, go! Seven nineteen. Fast group of riders coming in. Amy's coming right behind. We believe that's 301. She's coming right there. Hey baby, that should be 301. That should be 301. You got time for one more. Good job, one more.
12 minutes after. The only All the records can be a little bit higher than the other events. <laughs> Uh, I think I'm done. Thank you. Thank you. Way to go, Amy. <laughs> yeah, they were encouraging us all to do one more. So, no, no. <laughs> we can't go that fast anymore. So 306. 306. Alright. Yes. Right. Nice Thank job. You. Yay, I am all done. <laughs> <laughs> Next job. On her way. In first place, women 30 to 34, total mileage 306.5 from Holland, Michigan. Give it up for Amy Miller. Congratulations to all of our women 30 to 34 finishers, and especially to Emily Clark and Amy Miller. Congratulations, ladies. Job well done. All of our father son riders. Our next category, appropriately enough, will be father-daughter. In third place, with total mileage 547 even, from Holland, Michigan, Amy Miller and David Gearlings. In second, our top female rider, with 381.4 miles from Marshall, Michigan. Give it up for Catherine Roche Wallace. I once again remind you that our top male competitor has set a new national 24-hour record with total mileage of 494.8 miles. Give it up for Seattle, Washington's Chris Ragsdale. This is his fifth year winning the bowl. He has enough to have cereal five days of the week now. Congratulations to Catherine Roach Wallace and Chris Ragsdale. Overall, male, female, 2010 national 24 hour challenge champion. <laughs>